the GCSE for each topic is broken down into the conceptual fluency, the problem solving and in the reasoning. Some questions are actually incorporating all of those skills put together. Um, some are more basic, so for the weaker learners they have they can access the material initially and with help from their peers or from myself they can actually boost themselves up. For key stage three, it is uh, more of a transitional piece of work, I would say, onto the GCSE, but they've managed with Key Stage 3 to actually incorporate uh, the reasoning, the fluency and the problem solving at different parts. So ultimately, the Key Stage 3 flows naturally into the GCSE.